No ceremony can create a marriage. Only you can do that through love and honor, through dedication and perseverance, through talking and listening, through helping, supporting, and being there for each other, through laughter and tenderness, through learning how to forgive, how to appreciate your differences, and how to make the important things matter and to let go of all the rest. I love how thoughtful and caring you are about me and about our friends. I love the way you follow me around everywhere when you're tired. I love how hugging you makes the world a bit easier and problems a bit less sad. I pledge to listen to your advice and occasionally take it. <laughs> I pledge to never keep score, even if I'm totally winning. Most of all, I choose you. I choose you over and over and over, without pause, without doubt. I vow to keep choosing you. I love you. I promise to cheer when Vienna gets placed at the most livable city in the world again. I promise to take care of you even when you've had one too many beer at Oktoberfest or one too many shots at our wedding. Wink. <laughs> I can't promise to stop making you try weird food, but I can promise that I will listen to music with headphone on when you're working and try to be on time as much as possible. Your dreams become my dreams. No matter where life leads me, I know that as long as you are there, I am home. Ich liebe dich. And Christian kneeled down to propose to her. I remember how cheerful we all were when Trinity finally said the three magic words. What the fuck? <laughs> Marriage is not about putting on a beautiful gown or a nice suit. It is not about celebrating with friends and family and it is not about dancing until the late hours of the night. Although we will definitely do just that tonight. All of those things make wedding, but marriage is arguably the greatest and most challenging adventure in all of human relationships. 